Hello. Today we will be showing you how to use the Davis bow jig to tie your own bows. Tools that you will need to have on hand include the bow jig and hook tool, Davis ribbon, Davis latex band, and Davis shears. Optional tools you may also need include Davis hemostats and decorative pom-poms, beads, rhinestones, and a glue gun or super glue. An option for measuring the ribbon is to use the sides of the bow jig base to measure out the length. Adjusting the position of the pegs will increase or decrease the size of the bow. With the pegs in the position as shown to the left, the finished bow will be approximately 3 inches wide. Insert the ribbon into one of the bow jig clips. We at Davis like to start from the right side, making our way around. Once you've clipped in one end of the ribbon, guide the ribbon around to the front. Continuing around the back, making your way around the front, and once you're all the way around to the front, clip the tail end into the other clip as seen to the right. Notice the starting position of the tool and latex band. The latex band is to be held in front of the bow. Loop the latex band over tool and stretch band under the bow. Press down on the latex band with your thumb to hold it in place. Then bring tool up and over. Loop the latex band onto the hook at the top of the tool. Once the latex band is fully looped, pull upward, stretching the band. Maneuver tool into the position to the left. The bow jig tool tip hook portion of the tool is facing up or out. Turn the bow jig tool, ensuring that the smooth side is facing up. This will prevent the latex band from catching the tool hook when you slide it through. Pull steadily on the latex band, clenching down on the center of the bow. Voila!